Both legal men are in the ring and set to start things off here. We're ready to go. on the defensive here. It looks to me like his partner's itching to get in there. And now might be a good time to give him what he wants. I think a lot of people right now are scratching their heads wondering how he let this match get so out of hand. This might be it! Oh my! What a stomp! Good grief! Duty right hand. Boom! Ooh, 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 ooh. Nailed it. Just punched him right in the mouth. Oh, Relent. I say Drew McIntyre's career is a story of two completely. He's looking at it. Drew McIntyre is getting ready. Close line. Right in the back of the neck. He's not looking like himself here. At this point, a big headbutt. This might be the opportunity he... McIntyre looking to end this. Michael, I like your analogy of McIntyre's career as two different chapters. And while chapter one didn't necessarily blow anybody away, there was a foreshadowing of his future success. Well, even Mr. McMahon himself called McIntyre a future world champion, which, of course, later came true in 2017 when McIntyre defeated Bobby Roode for the NXT Championship. I don't think I've seen a superstar more driven to succeed than Drew McIntyre. When he was released in 2014, McIntyre said he'd be back, and that's exactly what happened. Oh, Mac. Mangle's got him locked up. One. Mangle's not done. Here comes another. Two. Kurt Angle tossing bodies everywhere. Big opportunity here. Following up on what you two were saying about McIntyre's initial release, not only did he return with more fire and fans, he also came back in even better shape than before. Yeah, McIntyre's always had a height advantage, but in his time away, he worked on his strength, conditioning, and added considerable power to his Claymore kick and Aftershock DDT. What a stomp! Good grief! Oh boy, he is rolling! Whoa, Angle dodged that one, but he's still got it. Kurt setting it up. Angle oh. slam. That's what he was looking for, Michael. Here's Superstar thinking Angle lock. Two options. Uh-oh. Angle's going to snap it. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? Drew McIntyre really needs to dig Drew down McIntyre deep and fast. In a tag team contest, a superstar and partner lock up against another duo. Unless there's a special stipulation added to the match, the traditional rules of a singles match apply in terms of winning the match via pinfall, submission, countout, or disqualification. Comes in off the tag. Just launched. He's struggling a bit here. In a standard tag team match, one competitor is in the ring against an opponent, and their teammate is in their corner standing on the ring apron. 
I should also point out that the competitor in the ring, as far as the referee is concerned, is the legal man. Only the legal man can attempt to score a fall over an opponent or be defeated by an opponent. In a tag match, when a superstar tags their partner, the person who tagged out has until the referee's count of five to exit the ring. For a tag to be considered legal, both of the superstar's feet have to be on the apron. The partner must be touching the tag rope in the corner. Both team members must touch, and the referee must see the tag be made. Over the last few years, the tag team... Look at that at a second time. Big slam. That should do it. I think that slam caught us all off guard. He's teetering up. Oh, what a clothesline. Forcefully delivered. He's going for the pin. The tag team competition right now is just... Yeah, and that's it. This one is over. Sometimes a match can't live up to the hype, guys, but that one sure did. That's the kind of match that makes me proud to be here at ringside. Action from the opening bell and a finish people won't soon forget. Tough to top that one, folks. We were lucky to be here to witness a match filled with technical prowess, here amazing moves, winners, and seemingly non-stop action. B.L. and Kurt Angle. Wow, now that's a commanding win. Now you just got to take the win and build off it. And I can imagine there aren't too many people at home regretting tuning in for that amazing match. Wow.